this experiment, we will extract eggacin from milk. Milk is a mixture of many types of protein, most of them present in very small amounts. They contain 80% of casein, whey proteins, and minor proteins. Casein is a heterogeneous mixture of phosphorus containing protein in milk. It is responsible for the opaque appearance of milk. Here are the materials we will be using. Here are the procedures. First, heat the distilled water to 40 degrees Celsius. To know the temperature, use a thermometer or simply dip your elbow to the water. If your elbow can tolerate the temperature, it means it is warm enough and ready to use. Second, measure 5 grams or 2 spoonful of whole milk. Third, pour 30 ml or 2 tablespoons of warm water and mix it into the milk. Fourth, Add drop by drop of acetic acid or vinegar while stirring the milk suspension. Observe the formation of the precipitate. The purpose of adding vinegar or acetic acid to the milk is to lower the pH of the milk and for the protein casein to reach its isoelectric pH. When this occurs, the casein will separate from the solution. Fifth, filter the mixture into a cup by pouring it through a cheesecloth or handkerchief which is fastened with a rubber band over the mouth of the glass from the precipitate by squeezing the cloth gently. The liquid filtrate contains fats and must be discarded. Use a spatula to transfer the filtered casein to another container. Sixth, add banan oil of ethanol or commonly known as alcohol to the beaker. Mix it for 5 minutes then filter it again using cheesecloth or handkerchief. Gently squeeze the cloth to remove excess ethanol. The liquid filtrate contains fat and must be discarded because the ethanol is less polar than water. It lowers the dielectric constant of the meeting potential and electrostatic interaction that play a key role in stabilizing the case initially. The increased solubility of colloidal calcium phosphate during acidification was also a contributor to micellar dissociation. The loss of this micellar electrostatic glue may promote casein to dis dissociation at elevated concentration of ethanol and low pH. Lastly, spread the casein on the paper and let it dry. Here is the final result of our experiment in extraction of casein from milk. Thank you for watching!